In this video, we'll see how to take the output of Open Orienteering Map and test it out in MapRunF using the Check Site feature. We'll also look at using Google Earth to accurately position the controls. On the MapRun website, select Check Site from the menu, and then click the link that takes you to the MapRun console. Enter a name for the event. This needs to be unique. The name contains a code that describes the type of the course. Here we use PXAC for a line course. The documentation lists the other valid codes, including those for scatter and score courses. For score courses, there are also various scoring options available. Check Sites is only designed for temporary usage, so you must specify an expiry date. The default is after seven days. Enter your name and email address. This is not made available publicly. Then upload the map and course files that you downloaded from Open Orienteering Map. Once you have clicked Submit, wait until a six digit code is returned, which we will then use in the MapRun app. You can safely ignore the warning about the lack of tiling as long as you're using the new MapRun F app. We'll now switch to the MapRun F app on your mobile phone. Clicking the icon bottom right brings up a menu from which you can select check sites. We now enter the six digit code that the website gave us. After a short delay, it will start downloading the map and course, and then we're ready to go. Just hit Go to Start when you're ready to begin. The course will then work in the same way as a normal map run event. If, after testing the course, you discover that some controls don't register at the correct location, you might need to adjust them using Google Earth. Here, we will use the Google Earth website, but you can also use the Google Earth Pro desktop application. Select Projects and then Open, and choose the Import KML File from Computer option. Locate the file you downloaded from Open Orienteering Map. To modify a control, click on the place mark and then select the pencil icon. You can then drag the place mark to the correct location. Click the back arrow to finish editing. Repeat as many times as is necessary. When you are happy with the location of all the controls, click the three dots and select the option to export the updated KML file. You can then use this updated file with check sites. If you're now ready to share your course publicly, Send the map and course files to your local MapRun administrator.